Okay, I am with local artist uh, Rinchen, who came all the way from Timbu uh, to show me how traditional Bhutanese paints work. So these are all um, clay that you can only get in Bhutan. So these are the primary colors, red, yellow, and blue. Look at that. And, um, and they, these are cow skin. And what you do is, in the old times, is uh, you have to melt it. You have to you have to heat it up, and it stinks. <laughs> it's quite smelly. Yeah. It's quite smelly, and it takes a long time for it because you then mix it. So in modern days, what people do is they take this, they put it, they immerse it under on a stove, make it melt to a consistency of sort of like liquid, and then you add um, some glue into it. So this is synthetic resin adhesive, which is wood glue. And um, later on, you can even mix it with acrylic colors to make it brighter because usually it's this color. So yellow is this yellow and this is this clay. And if you go around Bhutan and you look at um, the buildings, you will see a lot of the coloring, uh, a lot of the coloring um, on all the framings. And nowadays people um, mix it with acrylics to make it brighter. So thank you, Rinjin, for showing me. Brighter and water resistant. Yeah, and water resistant, correct. So thank you for this. Rinjin is a traditional, he's an expert in traditional painting, but uh, you're going into contemporary. <laughs>